think there's a big shift going on in terms of different perspectives. Everything from um, a more value-based consumption that we're seeing more and more. People are more aware of what they consume and why. And uh, you also see a shift in, in availability versus ownership, where you'd rather get the hole in, on the wall rather than actually owning the, uh, the drill. Uh, but also the biggest one of them all is, of course, uh, the digital disruption that's going on that we're, you know, being part of right now and where we don't really know what's, what effect it will have in the long run. It's hard to say three years time because see, everything is moving so fast right now. So perhaps we've come a long way um, in three years. But I think in uh, terms of the fashion industry, we will see uh, that customers can experience fashion in completely new ways and you have the possibility to update your wardrobe uh, in new ways as well uh, in terms of having a wardrobe that is a mix of long and, and short life garments, a mix of owned uh, and pre-owned garments but as well as uh, updating your wardrobe in new ways such as the rentals and things. So I. Um, and of course, the whole, whole uh, digitalization will also affect the way we actually uh, consume fashion, both in terms of where we buy and how we buy it, but also how we, when we are tired of a garment, uh, what do we do with it? Uh, yeah. Well, we're trying out, actually, uh, new business models uh, in order to, to find uh, a strong business model that will last in the long run. So, for instance, we're trying out uh, second-hand. Um, we're trying out rental uh, in our stores, in selected stores, so where you can go and, and rent your clothes uh, for four days, uh, whatever you want, for four days and then return them and we can rent them out again. Um, and also, what we're also doing is that we're taking back clothes that customers don't use anymore and reward them for doing that. And, and the main purpose of bringing them back is to make sure that they can get an extended life uh, through someone else. So, to sell it through second hand or give it away to charity. Uh, what we're also uh, evaluating and trying out is to uh, offer different services to customers. Except for rentals, we're also having a care concept where we want to help our customers prolong the life length of the garment. So how you care for it, uh, we help customers to mend it. So if something gets broken, we, we repair it. And we also try to help them and inspire them to you know, care for the garments, how you uh, wash, uh, how often you wash, <laughs> etc. And so that's also an important way of, of making sure that the products get that long life that they were meant to have. And to kind of just, you know, show respect uh, for the actual garment that you have, you own.